All right, guys, so this is a removal of actually a sealer that was put on there and applied to the whole house, but this particular tile is not uh, porous. And so the sealer just stuck on top of it. Although they used a penetrating sealer, if it's got nowhere to penetrate into, then it's gonna sit on top of it and it's gonna look awful and it looks like that. So that's why the customer called me out and had me test an area and I tested an area and I'm now back to clean it. I actually strip it. So I'm stripping it all off and I'm using a stripper to do it. Just simply using the Zep stripper. You can get it Zos, uh, <laughs> Lowe's. And um, just applying it, spreading it around, letting it sit for about five minutes. And then uh, going back over it with a neutral cleaner and picking it up. Then when I'm totally done with the whole area, then I'm gonna come back up here and just clean the whole thing. I'm doing it by hand. I, I'm almost wishing I brought my buffer so I could have got the bigger areas with the scrubbing. But what I'm doing is after it sits here for a while, I'm going over it with a pad, right? I'm just agitating it. Then I'm letting it sit a little longer and then just um, rinsing it out with it. Just like spraying it and, and using a rag for now. Then I'm gonna do an overall rinse neutral cleaner. When I'm done anyway, so double neutral cleaner on it and it looks pretty good. This is the part I did do. Tell the difference, you know. Um, customer's been struggling with this for a while. He called me out, and I just kind of did my little SPP pad tester, and it wouldn't come up. So then I knew that, yeah, we're gonna have to do some some chemical. So I came back out here on, when I did this carpet and tested a spot, and that's when I when I did that, and he was happy with it. So back to do this. All right. So yeah, not a fun job. A little bit of waiting, but. Once I, I did all the small areas that I already did in the bathroom there, all along the walls, all around. So now I'm just gonna hit the center, make my way out. Sealers, towel seal. Um, you gotta make sure you know what you're putting it on. Uh, the contractors put it on everything. And I guess the sun probably baked it in and made it look weird. But it's got worse looking and it literally started changing colors about two weeks after it was installed so right, uh yeah doing the research i had a little bit of time to think about it and research on it and stuff so back to do it and there's a stripper no, I'm gonna spread it around, make sure I didn't miss any. There it is. Then I'll let it sit for about five minutes and then do a little agitation and then let it sit for another minute or two and then pull it up. This is neutral cleaner. Just wiping it up.
All right, so now I'm gonna go through a, do a final rinse. I pre-sprayed everything um, using carpet details, neutral cleaner, and uh, it's just my hand deal here. I should probably pull out my bigger spinner, but I got another small bathroom and, and thing to do downstairs. So it'll be easy enough with this, I hope. I hate these things, by the way. I ended up starting out with those things and then putting it away, but I think doing this would be pretty easy. All right, sorry if I feel sound out of breath, but I'm marching up and down these stairs. after the rinse, looks beautiful. So we do have some staining in there, etching of some sort that will not come out with the cleaning. So yeah, unfortunately, but other than that, looks great.